Mr. Benoit. How nice of you to call. I was beginning to think that you were trying to avoid me. I, I didn't. I'm sorry. I'm sure you are, dear boy. I'm sure you are. I look forward to hearing all about it when you get here. I'm sure you have a perfectly reasonable explanation as to why Mr. Barnabas failed to receive the case he was expecting three days ago. Frank Hardy. He, he tried. He's going to kill me. Frank Hardy knows the meaning of loyalty, Mr. Wainwright. He'll do as I tell him to. Now, be a good boy and let me speak to Frank. <laughs> okay, it, uh, it needs some work, but um, you have to think of the potential. No, Mr. Brick Davis, it, it's perfect. <laughs> Please, uh, Mrs. Cooper, c call me Jonathan. Oh, is there planning permission? Because I have a five-year-old and we have another one on the way and I would like to extend out back. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> I think you could make this the perfect family home. Are there any concerns we should know about? Um. Solid old house, Mr. Cooper. Um, they built these old places to last. The owner... Uh, Inherited it from her mother um, 15 years ago and has uh, finally decided to sell. <laughs> but you haven't seen the gardens. <laughs> well, uh, I told her straight. I, I said, don't you speak ill of your dad. He might have his problems, lose his temper now and again, but he's never raised his hand to you. She said, and I guess he's never drank himself stupid either. Giving me special cuddles in the middle of the night. But when I shouted at her, filthy lies. How dare you come into my house and talk? about your dad with your filthy mouth. Get out! Get out of my house and don't you come back! She just stared at me. Never said a word. I wanted to stop her. Stroke her face, but I couldn't. So she left. And that, as they say, is that. <sighs> Telling me you were dirty. But she were telling truth, weren't she? I, I, I like a bit of a, a fumble as much as any other chap. Uh, do, do I get my fair share? <laughs> yeah. Uh, do I lust after a pretty body? Well, what man doesn't? I'm not married. I've got no kids. So, so, so why not? I'll be honest with you. I'm a bloody Japan. And young Gabby here, well, she's not exactly a nympho, is she? So that leaves you, doesn't it? Jesus, Bishop, just because you can't get it up doesn't mean you don't miss it. And just because she's only been with three blokes doesn't mean she hasn't fancied a night with five blokes hung like horses! Still here! No Of course, I bloody miss it! Who won? We have got to get this right, you know. All you can do is fantasise. I would call that lust, right? You call it what the fuck you want and leave me alone. We're running out of fucking time!